Supposed to be worn? Yes. It barely covers anything. Excuse me? Covers the front. What do you think of this? Uh, I like it, but I don't know. I'm not really feeling a jumpsuit. Not for a first date. Okay. Maybe something more classic. But what's well, with all the. Classic. Wait, wait, look, 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 look. There you go. Eh, uh, madam, no. Slit, low cut, alaza. Why no, do you no, think no, I'm no. wearing waxing? For what? Uh, why do you think I want to wax my legs and I'm, I'm all sore? But why are you waxing? Because I gotta show some legs and For anything what? can happen, you know. Just in it's case. a first date. Yeah. Something more demure. I mean, you can't be going and showing out you all the You don't know what to expect on a first date. Anything can happen. That's why you're telling him what to expect and not expect a whole lot hey, going madam. by the end of the night. Madam. Because at the end of the day, if he's seeing everything, he'll be expecting the end time benefits. Okay. I don't know. I, I sort of like it. Deep but plunge. I don't know. It's too clingy, probably. He's going to show too much. Okay. I think we need to give him guessing. Let him guess a little bit for the first time. Uh, hmm. Okay, so the thing is, he's not that but, tall. Uh -huh. So I don't know if I should wear high heels or I should wear flats. But why is he not that tall? Because, you know, good things don't always come in. <laughs> 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 but really, honestly, what's what is this? You never know. You never know about You need what? to look good underneath as well, you know? And then mm. once you look good underneath, you feel good. Plunge it up and, you know. He's not seeing anything underneath. He's not going to see anything, but, you know, something has to hold things. Do not prepare for things that will not happen. That's why oh, I say. Oh, don't say that. That's why you didn't see me. Oh, why oh, are oh, we... Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, hell no. Nah. <laughs> uh -uh. <laughs> no. Thank you very much. Showing Out. everything on the side. Back, and... back in. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, no way. You are just a hater. I don't know. No, but you see, that red one, mm -hmm. it looks the one be. Uh, this one ah, right here? Thank you very much. You see, it's nice and classic, airline. It shows a little bit. And but it's red. I love red. Theory, you know but I, mean? I don't want to appear too goody goody. Like, you know, that's the thing. We must say, no, the first date is all about impressions. So if we're giving him a goody goody kind of vibe, then uh, you know, I'm a grown woman. I'm 30 something. I can't just walk up there and look like uh, some little girl who no, just came out of high school. This is classic. Oh, this is please. lovely. This is elegant. You see, at the end of the day, then we'll figure out how to go. If he's crazy, then we can chalk him into the the crazy cabinet, but if he's oh, maybe I should find out. I should call him and find out what color of shoes or suit he's wearing. But why are we so matching? we can match. Yeah, but it's nice. So we walk into like a nice couple on the first date. Yes, that is for like a fifth wedding anniversary. <laughs> fifth wedding anniversary. <laughs> that is not. What, that is so not what, a what color shoes would go with that then? Hmm. Since we're doing red, something more dramatic, a uh, different color, maybe the blue. The I blue. like the blue up there. Yeah, but. You know, I think these, are, these looks, they look a bit too strappy. You uh, know? Okay, you're right on so that. So nude? I mean, two strong colors as well. Like, what do you think? So let's but this is nude. too strappy, I think. Uh, let's do nude. The nude pumps. Oh, yeah. The nude pumps. Nice, pump. classic, and you see? Nude pumps. Pretty. Yes. See, I like, I like, yes, I like the sound of that. Yes. But wait, why are we waxing again? I, I didn't get, I, I don't get it. Sister, let Why me tell you, you something. Anticipating? Let me tell you something. I need I need to wax because I want to show some legs. I mean, this dress is not particularly very long. And so maybe he doesn't like hair on the legs. And that, that might just take some max off. You know, I need to look good and so impress. So just the legs that were waxing on I, I, Well, I wax everywhere. You know, once you're there, why don't you just do everything? Why? No, he's not seen anything. So why are we preparing for something that's not going to happen? Oh, I God. mean, come on. I, look, I even bought him gifts. I did. Oh my god, my heart. Yes, I even what, bought what, him what, 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 what did you say? I, I just, I even bought him gifts. Cufflinks, cologne, you know. You might as well just give him a I got him, bloody hamper. I got him a shirt as well. Well, two shirts. Because, you see, the thing is, this is what I like to see on a man, so I'll buy it so that he can wear it. Is it his birthday? No, but it's a date. Just so he knows that next time I'll see him again, 
he needs to wear the things that I like him to wear. No, no, Does that no, make no, me no, no, a bit bossy? No, 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 no. Uh, I, I do not subscribe to that. I do not think that is what you should be doing. Wait, when was the last time you, you went on a date? But I'm not the one on, on the chopping block, there's you. When was the last time? It, I, I, am I the one on inquisition? When? Am I the one prepared? The no, am I the one the preparing time? for a date right now? It is not, it is not me. Oh, Anna is calling. I think I need a second opinion. Hold on. Hey, sweetie. Oh, yeah, the door. Like the door. <laughs> Anna, where are you? I'm come in, come in. Everything. <laughs> Anna, you have where? to see what she has actually gotten. <laughs> <laughs> no way. I bought, uh, yeah. How? How? Uh, yeah. Are you sure? serious? What is it that you got? <laughs> yes. For who? Yeah, my date. Oh, you, 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 you. Because? You, you, girl. Oh, you, you. I got some cufflinks as well. Oh, she, oh, 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 oh. Uh, but. For what? Who is this guy? Why are you buying all of these things? I mean, are you know, actually. I don't understand. Yeah. For what? You're serious. I haven't. I, well, I don't know what to expect. I, I mean, I'm pretty much sore from the waxing as well. I'll be right back. So you are ready for it. She's I need ready a drink for that we all need ready for it. <laughs> oh, let me see this thing. So this girl Actually, is ready. Mm, oh, Lord No one mercy. gift. No one gift. One, two, three. It, like she's taking this. a whole hamper. Hmm. Might as well just buy the dude. Like, come on. Honey. Oh, this is much better. Shut up and drink. Thank you. Oh, no, because I am not under I do not get it. Like, okay. <laughs> I'll explain to you. I don't know what to expect. So I just have to go prepared. But you it's a date. Out. Yes. Thank you. But not a presentation. Look, it could turn out into something else. I mean, it could turn out into something amazing. As in. As in. in so what? What's the big deal? Are we already planning for first a First of all, sorry, who is this guy? Where is this guy I met? Mm. Why? You met what, where? What has that got to do with anything? You buying, you buying all of these kids for a guy that... First of all, we are your friends and we have friends. Like, I haven't even heard about this guy. What does he do? Guy? It doesn't How much does he end? Does he, does he, Which school do you go to? Yeah. Wait! Uh, wait, no, wait, wait, we need, we need to understand does this. It, does it matter? Does of course it matters. Care? Really? If you take of someone course. to a pricey place and he cannot pay, what is going to happen to you? Huh. Well, I thought, what happens to chemistry? I, I, you know, you see Is there any chemistry in between you? Yeah, because that's why we're going on a date. And Child. that's why you bought all of these kids for him. I just thought I should take a And gift. that's why you walk yourself. Oh my God. Well, cheers to that, I guess. Oh. <laughs> okay. Now, let, 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 let me, let me, let's talk about this. Okay. Break it down. Okay, let's break it down. What the person earns, where he works at, mm -hmm. what he looks like. Mm -hmm. Does it even matter when yes. you're going on a date? Well, it depends. On what? Hey, it doesn't always matter. How? But I'm single and boy meets girl. A girl, boy meets girl. Boy says, you're cute. I want to take you out on a date. Honey, honey. Why honey. not? That does not work anymore. So well, how does it work then? Dating right now is a calculation. Okay. You are calculating who you want to get. Okay. At a particular rate in time, you want to know what he earns. You want to know what he does. You yeah, want to know where he went to school. Isn't that why we're going out to drinks? But and you should already dinner. know these things before you even start planning on making No, no, no. She doesn't dinner. need to do that. Let um, your Latina come out as okay. I do. Oh, yeah. Okay, so mommy. it's all about attraction, mm. it's all about vibes and energy. Yeah. The guy is cute. Yes, he's very cute. He invites you on a date. I'm yeah. sure he'll take you to a nice place. Yeah. Is it relevant if he he's pays or not? No, always take money in case. You might need to pay. And then he might end up being the guy of your life. You Should never I? know. I mm. give you, I, I'll give you an example. His attraction is energy. So one time, yeah, mm -hmm. I did, a guy calls me out on a date. So this guy I really didn't know. I was like, okay, let's see how it goes. After all, I have nothing to do on a Saturday night. I go out to dinner and I choose the place. I asked him initially that, oh, pick the place. The guy says, oh, no, you decide. I'm like, okay. I picked a really pricey place, assuming this guy can pay for it. We get to the dinner location. Then I start ordering. I ask the guy, what do you want? He's like, oh, he doesn't want anything. I do not get it. Ah, is it that you're not hungry? Oh, he ate before coming. Is it that you're not hungry? The guy says he ate before coming. What do you want? The guy says water. Bring, uh, they ask, is it sparkling? <laughs> they ask, sparkling or still? The guy says, give me pipe. Oh. That's when I realized that there's oh, a problem yeah, 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 yeah. there. Yeah, but you know, AJ, on a regular day though, would you go to that pricey restaurant? Ask yourself that question. If I can, on a first date, on a you good shouldn't, day, you shouldn't I would. pick a very pricey restaurant yeah. for Why a first not? date because you put in expectations that you don't even know if it's gonna because happen. Because these are no. expectations that I want to set for myself. No. Would you take? Like, that's something that the question is: Would you go out to a very expensive place on your own? Like yes. That place like that. Would you go out there? 
I would on a special day. So meeting you is a special day. So let us go to a place that I like on a special day. So what was your reaction when the guy said, you know what, you only want water? Maybe he wasn't hungry. At the end of the day, yeah. And I decided to test it out. I was like, okay, you know what, finally, uh, the food comes. I'm like, finally, okay. Do you want to get some deep bites or maybe grab for mine? Oh, I can't eat it all. The guy's like, oh, no, no, no. After like 10 minutes eating it, the guy's like, oh, how about picking one? Literally, the guy split my dinner in half. Holy Okay, he split the dinner in half. The guy okay. was hungry. That's, that's a very, he could not that's, buy that's a very his very special case. plate. Wait, are people even dating these days? Like, that's the question. Like, I don't even know. I don't even know what's yeah, going on. Yeah, I haven't dated for like three years. I don't think people date anymore. People just jump into relationships. Yeah. Honestly. Because it's, okay, back in the day, you expect a guy to say, baby, I like you. Mm -hmm. Baby, let's go on a date. After the date, you know, I want to take this further. Right now, guys don't, they don't even want to toast you. They basically say, okay, go out on the first date, go out on the second date, next time, let's go to my place. After that, you're basically in a relationship. Ah, so they only no. tell you go to my place on the third date. These Some, guys, they say on the first date. You see, uh -huh. I was, I was, I was going to say. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> now, guys lately, I think, uh, which I don't think, you know what, I, I'm going to be, I'm going to play the devil's advocate a little bit. Mm -hmm. Because some certain guys would, take you out on a date and they want to you like you feel like a piece of meat after you go out on a date with them you know this all they see is they just want to jump into bed with you exactly. you know and you know I, I i keep saying yeah it's gonna happen but don't make it that blatant don't make it don't make me feel like a piece of meat so then where do you draw the line is it the first date you meet the guy? If you if you feel like you want to do something with the guy, do you go ahead and do it? You see, if the guy sort of exactly. If, so it's you need, a, if it's a mutual thing, so let's you look say, at you it. You give it a rule side. and say, you know, I have six months, three months rule. You can't do it until we, I get to know you a little bit. So I mean, wh why we, we don't look at it in the other side? Sometimes you go out on a date, mm -hmm. first date, and the guy is extremely handsome. Yeah. You have such a good chemistry. Yeah. Uh -huh. The dinner is going very well. well. The conversation is very interesting. You do see a future with the guy, and you really feel attracted to the guy. So you do want to jump in bed with that guy. You feel like you want to. Yeah. So it's not always that we're expecting the guy. Oh no, this guy, they always want to jump into bed with Sometimes us. And the because women, we also do. Yeah, of course. We also course. do, and especially no. these days. Yes, we also I, do. I completely object to that, that okay. mindset. Because a girl should not be jumping into bed if, it, if the guy has great chemistry with him. Because at the end of the day, after it happens, then what? Standards have not been set. You yeah, but, but even if you wait two happening. years or three you years and it happens, then what? Yeah. And then you know that at least two years, three years, I've known this person. I know his quirks. I know his likes. And after three likes. years, if he dumps you, what are you going to do? And then it's the will of God. So it's the will of God. But if you actually jump into it, it's like, okay, right now, it's, it's, like, it's like a process. He's un unraveling a parcel. Mm -hmm. So you're the parcel. So the first layer is, is uh, the first date. Now he's getting to know how you are mm -hmm. on the first night. Mm -hmm. Then he goes into the second date, the okay. third date. Then it's like a, a little bit of a, a gift that keeps on giving. Yeah. Then finally, it is when you open. So this is the question. Do you really need to know the guy in order to go to bed? Yes. No, you don't. Yes. No, you don't. Not these days. I mean, I think, I think again, devil's advocate. I think it depends on the person. Mm. The maturity level is also very important. You know, age, maturity. Now, the difference between age and maturity are like vast. vast. Correct. So, um, a guy could be very matured and dumb as a pot. Very, as a, very as young. As a very, yes. very young. <laughs> you know. So, where, where, how do you know that okay, these guys are mature enough to know that if we go to bed, if I quote unquote sleep with him? He's not, gonna day, go he's not gonna go blabbing or he's not gonna go um he's not gonna dump you after that because i mean why pay for the cow when you can get the milk for free you, you right? haven't you no. haven't you never done that kids have you never done that no as I women you have never done that i don't want, no. go on a day with a guy and then you don't like it so after the first date and then you just don't call him anymore because i have done yeah of course so but, 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 but you didn't sleep with him that's the difference you didn't sleep with him you meet a guy okay yes. chances are you meet the guy, he, you didn't see the car he's driving. Uh -huh. He's coming to take you out on a date. Do you drive yourself or do you let him pick you up? Oh, let him pick you up. Drive no, yourself. okay, fine. That one so, is nice. Drive yourself. Oh, you really? drive Yeah. One I thing. I drive myself. He may be crazy, yes. ladies. I he agree. may be oh, crazy. He picks you up from your house, he knows your house. 
if it goes wrong after the bat, if, if it goes on the bat, me, be chasing fact, you. I don't oh. want, I, I'll give you another example. <laughs> that's, that's why you take money. Let me give you that's another you example. So you can go Let me time. give you yeah. another example. So this guy, yeah, I met this random guy. And he's like, oh. AJ, I always meet random guys. I meet random guys. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So I met this random guy. And he's like, oh, uh, he'll come around my place. So I immediately told him that he should go two streets away. I told him two streets away and I made him park there. And I walked to him. Then I get there and I sit in the car. And he starts talking. And in like a minute, I was turned off. Mm -hmm. I was put off. And I told him, oh, I've left my house keys. And he's like, oh, let him drop me. I'm like, no. I'm going myself. I'm, I, uh, no, I have to pick something. So I literally get up from the car and dodge in uh, into the, there's a, a shop around mm. there so i go in there and i went in the guy had not moved the guy was actually waiting for me to walk mm. back to my house to figure out where i lived they, where do you meet these guys crazy people. where do you meet these guys aj i don't even know I, and i don't think you have had that experience before have you? i haven't met random guys like that there's something like, there's something <gasps> they like always like pick me in a nice no. car take me to the I'm, restaurant I'm, and bring I'm, me back I'm home i'm very friendly so I get, I meet a lot of people in a lot of settings and, you know, I, I'm, I'm not against being toasted. Being There's nothing yeah. wrong with being friendly. But, but I just think so, that sometimes they're crazy. Yeah, like, people they're are crazy. But okay, so let's, let's make a statement well. here. Let's uh -huh. make a statement here. Mm -hmm. We're all friendly. Yeah, we're yeah. all friendly. Yeah. We like to be liked. Mm -hmm. And yeah. when we meet guys, we feel that vibe. We like it. We mm -hmm. like that energy. Yeah. Right. So why is it that important at this point, which car is he driving? If he's gonna pay for the bill, oh, now you're changing your tone. Now uh, uh, you're changing your tone. Uh, <laughs> it's all about love, girls. I'm yeah, sorry. Love, no, 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 love. no, no, no. Love don't live here no more. No, I don't think it's about love when you meet a guy. Like you said, love don't live here you have no to be calculating. But where do you draw the line without being too calculated mm. and seeming like you're in for? The obvious things like you know the fancy cars, the picket fence, and you know. Don't forget also the guys feel this because yeah. they used to girls to just use them, so they also get this feeling of like, oh, this girl is only interested but in who, the money I have. Who told you if that I'm guys... gonna pay for dinner or no, and they might be like, you know, well, no, no, no. But guys are also very calculating. Calculating, yeah. Mm -hmm. Guys are not tell, are not randomly. They see a Jocelyn, they're like, oh, Jocelyn's a fine girl. She's like, she, she's good. Fine she has, girl she like has you. a great job. <laughs> she has a fancy car. She is the whole package. You understand? She's a ten, mm. and they want to date a ten. Because you they don't, they they don't want you. to spend too Let much. Let me tell you something. You're all Latina flavor and everything. You're a ten. No. You understand? And so is AJ. AJ is a ten. Thank you very much. All, you right. know, all of this gotta go somewhere. So. <laughs> <laughs> But you know, they then decide that they want you or you or me. They are not going for a regular Jane. Do you understand? Mm. Guys these days also have their standards. They're not look. They're looking for a brother that's also bringing something on board. So they've calculated that. Okay. I'm, so I'm, you I'm going really sorry on, about this, but you know what? I think it's not fully like that. Guys these days are very scared of women like us. Because mm -hmm. we are pretty independent, sorry to say. We are independent, we are powerful. Mm -hmm. We don't need them anymore. So they feel no, intimidated the, no, by us a little bit. I don't think a guy should be scared of women like us or intimidated. Mm -hmm. I think, I, for me, I think it's very sexy. I, I want to meet a guy. I don't want to meet a guy who is just at home and is a bum. Exactly. Right. And I, mean, I don't think a guy wants to meet any girl who is just at home waiting like a bird for him to drop a worm in his mouth Imagine. every day. You understand what mm -hmm. I'm saying? So I think that the, the, where you draw the line is where the problem is. You know, you don't have to rub it in each other's faces. Mm -hmm. As in, I'm making money and I'm da-da-da-da-da. So you have to... Give me that respect, kitchen, kitchen. I think that's where the problem is. You know, so uh, most guys just want respect, mm -hmm. you know. So my I, thing I, is, I, I, I my thing is, do. how yeah. do you? Yeah. Ha and so do we. Women yeah. also want respect. So on yeah. the first yeah. date, you can't disrespect me and expect me to call you for another date. Imagine. Or when you call me and tell me you want to see me again, I'll come. Yeah. No, it's not gonna happen because once I feel like a piece of meat, and there are so many ways to disrespect a woman or a man. Mm -hmm. Like I'm saying, on the first date, don't look at me and make me feel like I'm some piece of meat. Imagine. Don't let me feel like it's all about sex. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's the problem. Now, my thing is, when you go and sit there and you have a date with a guy, what are the questions that you can ask? And where, where are the boundaries? Well, this one here, she wants to get all the information. Because me, so. <laughs> me, I mean, for me, where do you I'll ask you, do you do? first of all, how old are you? <laughs> okay. How old are you is right. Mm. How old are you? Yes. Is it age, right? Age is nothing but a number, baby. No, honey, it, it, it's um, important. Tell me why. I mean, look. It's as much as I like, and I will say this: mm -hmm. I, li I like good-looking, hard-working, ambitious men. Okay. But then, you know, sometimes the age factor also Affects. sort of puts me off a little it bit. Does. When you're too old and, ugh, but I, I like them young and, you know. But how do but you then, ask? But maturity is also very important. Mm -hmm. So those things are. That's why I'll ask you how old you are because I need to know your level of maturity, and but I know it's, it sounds uh -huh. stupid because. Mm -hmm. 
age doesn't necessarily really much equal mature, maturity. Yeah, correct. But I, I don't know. Why are you coming on a date with me? I don't what do you want from me? How old are you? Are you divorced? I, I need to know these things. Mm -hmm. You know, why, why do you want to date me? Why me? That's, like you yeah. say, there's so many other girls. I why ask that me? question all the time these days. Why like, do you choose me? No, why Why me? Why, Why? okay, so... Why are you here with me now? First, first thing is, you are a successful man, mm -hmm. I'm assuming. You have a great job. Mm -hmm. You are of a certain caliber. Mm -hmm. Why are you single? But why are you like, single too, AJ? Because of Correct, work. it's exactly the same. That's so his, probably his, his is also because of work. So I want to know that. I want to know that. Is there, and why isn't there another girl that has snatched you off the market? Maybe he's not interested in and that also, girl. And also, age comes into play. Because um, my friend told me this, that if a guy above a certain age tries to date you, it will be hard because he's set in his ways so much, you can't change him. Right, and, and same the, with a girl. A, and a, a, to an extent, girls are more... Flexible in that yes. sense. No, yeah. we, we, no, can, we can no, compromise. No. I beg girls to differ. can compromise. I beg to differ. I won't compromise. I won't. No, not on your standards, but in living. I won't, okay. I won't compromise in my living as well. because I, I have, yeah. yeah, that's exactly the point. Yeah. No, a man that has lived in his space, mm -hmm. he's say 40, He's mm -hmm. lived alone for most of his life. Yes, mm -hmm. he's so used. Usually, those kind of guys have OCD. A woman that has lived in her space exactly the same. and is still forty is yeah. also very set in her way. Yes, she's yes. Used yes. To I'm almost a certain 30. kind of life. She doesn't want to come home and someone will ask her, "Why are you not coming home?" It's no, yeah. no, no, but no, no. Uh, again, you know, she's, she, she loves let, her independence. Let, 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 let's be real. We live in a very chauvinistic, male-dominated world, and women are supposed to. Um, be flexible. Are we? No, 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 I'm not. No, 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 no. In certain ways, no. No. when you marry, you are men do not think that it's okay to start up, uh, uh, having to report to a woman or discuss things with a woman because they're so used to being their own men. But a woman is almost programmed in some ways to see marriage as a partnership that mm -hmm. she's going into, and she now has a man that is in her I, life. I think, I think you're going a bit far because we're talking mm -hmm. about dating. No, marriage is like you're going in there. <laughs> we must always. Think ahead. Oh please. Let's think. We're having it. We're going to be the man of your life. I'm dating you. Let's see how it goes. You know. I mean, no. To be honest, though, uh -huh. when a guy says, "I want to date you," let's go on a date, or we're dating. What does that mean? I, I'm so confused. Well, like, because, let's go on a date. It's an invitation. In my opinion, you can date ten guys in two months just to see who is what. I think to the build Ghanian, them out. Is the you know, but in context. Ghana, if you, if you, exactly. I think on this you can do that. You can't can do that. Africa. No. Okay. Yeah. Africa, dating is seen as a relationship on its own. People are always saying, I'm dating him. Are we making a mistake, though? It, it is, because yeah. dating is just actually circling in Getting the pool. Getting to know each other. Trying to figure out who is who. Then yeah. you graduate into a relationship. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But people, young guys and girls, actually assume that dating is dating. Okay. Dating is a relationship. Okay. Once I start dating you. But dating is just going yeah, out Yeah, but why? Dinner. Because we, we are starting from the point now that when you go on a date, there's already something going on. That's why you're assuming. Before, you used to yeah, like date with somebody that you didn't even know. I mean. These days, there's already something going on. So when you go to the date, there's already a standard there. Mm -hmm. You know you like the guy, time, okay. talking thing. a little bit, there's attraction. So, so what, what standard would you, would you say that you can sort of lower when you meet a guy that you like? For instance, me. If I meet a guy who is, um, you know, I think for me, the ultimate deal breaker, when you, when you, when, if you ask me, is if I meet a guy and he has bad breath mm -hmm. okay I don't care how good looking you are and I'm, I'm such that it's I'm so sensitive when it comes to other smells yeah mm, exactly so, so when you have bad breath and it could be mouth or bio that's like a, a complete deal breaker I don't care if you drive the funciest car mm -hmm. I don't care if you have the nicest house or you you show me a gold or platinum <laughs> or whatever card or whatever it is it's just a deal breaker mm -hmm. you yeah know? so what is the ultimate deal breaker for you Anna I hate why socks? <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you serious? Are you this is very real though. I met a guy serious? once, he was really handsome, basketball player. Oh, wow. Really, really, white like socks. very good looking. We went on a date, we were in London, really nice. And the guy turned up with white socks. Be That's still my I say, you know what, you can pay for dinner by me, I'm going to my house. Hold <laughs> up, hold up. <laughs> Hold up, hold up, hold up. What is up, yours? Up, These white socks, oh, the... Get out of here. Wait, no, no, what do no, you no, say? No. White socks. Forget, please that is, know in my life. That no. is like the no way. That, that's, that, 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 that's a weird thing. Yeah. What about you? What's the deal breaker for you? Um, low intellect. Okay. I love fine. I love mm. intelligent conversations. Mm. Of I I thrive on it. And every time I go on a date, and the guy cannot speak or meet me at a point, I want like let's have Talk. an intelligent conversation. It's like 
like nails pricking my conscience and I will get tired. So even if it has bad breath, bad body odor, you, you don't care. You can handle that. You can handle that. You can handle white no, socks. No, I can I, I can handle white socks. <laughs> <laughs> I can handle white socks too. Be, be, uh -huh. BO, I'll, 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 I'll give you a, I'll make not a second chance, but there must be a reason. I perhaps, mean, with a BO, perhaps. Be Perhaps you're like having a long, you maybe a construction that's an, an excuse, engineer, really. right. and that's then you have excuse. you didn't get home no. to shower before I, coming I, I to think, me. I think men will sit down and say the same thing. Like you can't tell me that you've been out at work all day, so you have feel. That's, yeah. that's that's a, that's not an excuse. Also, this intellectual thing. Do you really get to see this on the first date? Yes. I don't think so. Yes. Sometimes the first date is all just to get time. to know each no, other. But all the time. Those all the time. One time, a guy that he had been asking me out for a long time. We went to dinner. AJ and his stories. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I'm a story girl. Like I have experiences. So, uh, I went to dinner. Very nice. It's Kaiba actually. Very nice, mm -hmm. nice and everything. Mm -hmm. And he starts talking, and I start getting tired. Like he was. It drains it me. Drags, if I have, yeah. if I have bad conversation, it drains me. But you know, and it, you it, see it, it on my it, face. AJ, I don't think. I don't want to. I, I wouldn't put it as intellectual conversation. Good conversation is good conversation. You know what I'm saying? So I don't think that intellectual really for the first day. Being able to the engage. reason why I was dragging this is because it's probably not because he's talking about. He's talking about himself most of the time. Really. That's, mm -hmm. no, that's, Correct, not, yeah. that's not good conversation. Nobody but some people talk about that. themselves and it's intriguing. And I will sit down and I'll listen and I'll ask questions. Do you understand? We it's can intriguing talk about because you're probably already attracted to this guy. No. One, like I can just vibe of a great conversation like start talking talk about politics talk about sports talk mm. about anything maybe but maybe, so long maybe, as maybe maybe a guy makes so long as you make talking about my tv show it's okay i will listen yeah i will understand i will be happy to talk so what back is, what to is, you what about is a, what is a dumb conversation in your opinion